Hello and welcome to another Yakuza 5 100% Trophy Guide video. In this video we're going to talk about Silo. So these ones tend to take a lot longer, the Silo, the Uchikabu, the um, Koi Koi, other ones like that. Uh, especially if the computer's getting lucky, which Mr. Musashi over there, getting the Reaper, was absolutely wrecking me. So. Essentially, I think you have to get uh, 20,000 points. Uh, you can use, you know, the Piss Mountain Stone, or you can use the 123 Gum. That will help you uh, in some ways. If you roll a 123 uh, as the banker, I think that gives you some sort of uh, some sort of bonus. I'm not. I'm not sure if you if you have it as the banker, it, if it's a detriment or like because sometimes when you roll well as a banker, you lose automatically. But if you did it as a, a, a player rather than a banker, then you you like gain exponentially. It's really weird. But the, the another problem with this is that they don't all bet the same. They they bet kind of what they've got. So if they're running out of chips or whatever, you want to uh, quit and then restart. So a hand in this game basically is if you get a double and a oh trips five of course if you get a double and a number then the number that was singular is the number that you'll have so one to six would be the usual case if you get triples that's pretty good uh, if you get I can't remember which one Mus Musashi is it was at the start of the video. If you roll like a certain order of numbers that counts as a Musashi, then you get Musashi. If you roll a 1, 2, 3, you know, it's alright. If you roll... I don't, I don't know all the hands, but essentially, just keep rolling. Put in, you know, whatever you can bet. I'm pretty sure I lost money doing these ones. Like, I think my luck was just terrible. Make sure you go in uh, on a lucky day as well. Don't do what I did on a bad luck day. And uh, get wrecked. Oh, nice. Roll five. So I think if you do the one roll triple, you uh, potentially triple your earnings. I'm not 100% sure. But it uh, seems to work well. But yeah, Celo's a bit of a bit of a boring game. You have to... The banker switches every, every turn. So like after one full set of people have gone, the banker switches to the next. Uh, and it's all just based on luck and RNG, so you can't really fix this one too much. Oh, trip six. Yeah, that must be good. Does it count as an automatic loss because he's the banker? No. Now, of course, again, the Reaper wins again. Classic. But yeah, good luck with this one. It's, uh, it's not the best. A little bit tricky, but uh, hopefully you'll get there. It's just a time consumer. Fingers crossed you'll nail it though. Thank you very much for watching and uh, peace out.